A therapist uses you to meet their own needs. They, you're like the daughter that they never had. And you're a client who struggles with attachment issues from a young age. In my case, I was adopted and then didn't bond with my adoptive parents. So when my therapist told me that I was like the daughter she never had, it was like an answer to prayer. It was like the missing piece, the thing that I'd always wanted and needed. Maybe this was the thing that was gonna bring me the healing that I had been chasing my whole life. So I took the bait and I followed this trail for quite a while until it all blew up in my face and left me utterly hurt. When a therapist uses a client to meet their own emotional needs, they're crippling the client. They're hurting the client. This is never in our best interest. This is always in theirs. Therapists cannot be our parents, our friends, our partners. They can only be our therapist. And they need to help us find those things in our own lives or meet them inside of ourselves. If you found yourself in a situation like this, please look for an ethical therapist who can help you because remaining in this extreme attachment with your therapist is only going to end up leaving you hurt. And just think about it. What if something happens to the therapist? They get sick, they die, they move away. Where is that going to leave you? That's going to leave you utterly alone with no coping skills and no support because they have hogged it all for themselves. They have fostered such an attachment and a dependency on them that now you don't know how to function without them. They have made themselves your number one sole source of support. They have convinced you that you can't live without them. You need to run from this kind of therapist.